Come and open your mouth and worship him tonight. Come and open your mouth and let's magnify him tonight. Come on, somebody, let's shout hallelujah. Glory to God. Behold, he comes riding on the clouds, shining like the sun. Behold, he 
Jesus of Elijah, of the days of your servant. Hallelujah. Fight inward and outward. Physical and spiritual fight. But we said there is no God like Jehovah. He's our back of ox. Hallelujah. Somebody praise God. I'm rejoicing tonight. I come this far by faith, leaning on the Lord. It is not of my own will or my own strength, but of God. Somebody praise God. Let me take time to greet our general over at Winston Baker. Amen. I believe that we are all family tonight. Amen. And we are on the preacher's time. I want to say welcome greetings to everyone here tonight amen just feel free to worship god come on somebody clap your hand amen and if there is any visiting church just see yourself we are one father's children somebody praise god label have nothing to do with it amen somebody in one god amen and we are heading for one place ministers amen on the podium tonight come on stand all ministers evangelist missionary praise god give god a shout of praise come give god one more shout of praise ministers amen amen missionary baker so good to see you tonight amen amen good to have you in our midst tonight praise the lord everybody praise the lord everybody Amen. Our general is here. Amen. All tucked out in his army suit. Mighty God. Some demons in trouble tonight. Somebody give the Lord a praise. Somebody give the Lord a praise. Amen. And I'm under his wing. Amen. All tucked out in my army suit. Standing behind him tonight. Because I got some demons in Peter's veil. Amen. Who think that they have the battle, but we have the victory. Somebody praise God. Somebody praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. I want this church to stand with me because I ain't going to keep up the preacher no longer. Somebody stand with me in the house, everybody. Amen. Our bishop is geared up and ready. We know he's tired. Praise God. He's preaching here tonight and he has to preach at Waterloo tomorrow night again. Somebody praise God. Stretch your hand towards the man of God. And release strength. Put your hands together as we make welcome to this podium. Our apostle and bishop. Bishop George Winston Baker of the King Jesus Pentecostal Give God praise the name of Come on and smile and say And say neighbor To you Nothing good to pass Said, there is a part in your poor old to God. 
they will never leave it. Stop by to tell somebody it is yes, the part. The church coming like about a few. Oh, tell a neighbor. Hours. The king is gone. I point on the person and said, Are you experiencing this? And the start, your person start to cry. And, uh, and, 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 uh, and, and, and we pray again on the holy branch. And we pray again on the holy branch. Take the mess and take the mess and we are on the big Nice red cheers and yeah. praise the name. God want to bless you. Just connect you. Yeah. Lamar. We are launch. Coming to book launch this year. But I know the devil is mad, you know. But don't worry, God is. God is a good God. Can you stand with me, please? Let's run to the Bible real quick and, and jump on the team for him. He can come. For you stood by me this night. I'm not alone. The angel of God, oh, lo, God hath given thee all the men that sail with thee wherefore sirs be of good cheer for i believe god that it shall be even as it was told me how be it we must be cast upon a certain island glory to god we can stop it right there let us talk to our daddy eternal god our father God that declared, let there be light, and there was light. We thank you tonight, great God of Abraham, Isaac, and of Jacob. Here we are tonight in Petersville. We are here because your spirit pulled us in this place. Oh God, please, in the name of Jesus Christ, somebody is here tonight because they need a word from you. Somebody is here because they need a touch from you. Somebody's here because they need direction from you. Father, please show yourself to be strong and mighty among your people. Give high ranking angels charge one more time. Give them swords of fire. Let them execute the judgment that is written. Father, please, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, arise and let all your enemies be scattered. Somebody lift your hands and say, Lord... Please have your way tonight. Clap your hands and praise the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Come on, clap your hands and give God one more praise. Turn to your neighbor and say, neighbor, my good neighbor, be of good cheer. No life shall lost. Come on, reach the three more people and tell them, be of good cheer. The devil can't kill you. Purpose is on your life. Clap your hands and praise the name of the Lord. Come on, warriors, clap your hands and magnify God. Clap your hands and lift Jesus higher. You may be seated in the presence of the most high God. I remember, I remember as I read this text i remember some times ago i was an unsaved and hallelujah there was this girl that i think she kind of liked me and her boyfriend was a shatter somehow she said some stuff to her boyfriend because you know when you're in the world and you dance, dance group and your name is calling and the, something go down that line and she said something to him and he's now 
free in me. But I have friends that that's in Savlama. I have friends from Kingston. I have a friend from Matches Lane named Norman and, and two others uh, from downtown Kingston. You know the connection. And so they come to Savlama with guns. And so, you know, every time you're a young man and you're connect with gun, you make you feel bad, powerful. So, somehow, the young man attacks me. But my friends was there. And threat take place. And my friends decide that they're going to kill them. And them decide they're going to kill me. But remember, I am from South. They are from Kingston. So them, all them are going to do, do them thing and go to Kingston and left me in the heart of clubs. And you're coming with me. And so right in the midst of everything and hallelujah, the, 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 the boy and his friends know they're planning for me. And I am now planning with my friends how we're going to get wipe them out. Hallelujah. But right in the midst of that, I went to a hotel to dance. And my friends that is in the dance group, hallelujah, that's in Runaway Bay, they left me that morning early and said they have some errands to run in Montego Bay. And so I was left alone in the hotel room. And right in the midst of everything, I got a visitation from heaven. I went into that bathroom for the first time, kneel on my knees, and I said, Jesus, if you're real, I want to know. I didn't know nothing about Paul, but a light shined in that bathroom and hit me to my hit me on the ground and God began to speak to me. My life was changed forever. We left when I left from Runaway Bay, that hotel, and go because we would dance Friday night at Runaway Bay and Saturday night we would dance at, at, at Sea Castle. Hallelujah. And the north course there from Runaway Bay to Sea Castle. Hallelujah. So in the morning, I, uh, I would left in the morning, Saturday morning, to Sea Castle. I was the first to reach at Sea Castle when my friends came back. From the town in Montego Bay, they saw Baker sitting on the bed with a Gideon Bible reading. And my friend Shaba said, Watch a Baker turn Christian. They did not know that God visited me. That Saturday night I was supposed to dance and the routine that we would do, it's called Mark the Christians. So that routine is a dance routine, you know, dance group, yes. And so the routine that we would do is like a skit. So we would be dancing our dance hall music and in the midst of the music, because we had the music on CDs at that time, so we build the CD and we just give it to the disc jockey and they play it. So in, in the routine, we would be dancing dance hall music. And uh, hallelujah. In the midst of the dance hall music, then a gospel song would come on. And in the midst of the gospel song, preaching would start. So we would have two persons acting like the members and one acting like the pastor. Uh, so two would be getting in spirit and, uh, and one would have the mic like a preacher. My preach, we call that routine mark the christian that saturday night when uh, hallelujah we finished the dance hall routine and it's time to switch over oh jesus mocking the christian something fall on me and instead of mocking the christian uh, tears begin to run down my eyes on the dance floor and uh, I didn't know the anointing at that time but a shaking and a quaking begin to move my body I got to come off oh shia basa where is the worshippers in here 
Oh, somebody wave your hands and, and so back into West Milan now, back into West Milan. Oh, I end up now have to find a church. And now I am at Barclay Street. Hallelujah. That Bishop Nepal in Savlamar Barclay Street across from Hallelujah, the library, that street down there. I'm there now. And hallelujah. God now is dealing with me. I'm now seeking the Holy Ghost. And because now I end up baptizing Jesus' name and I'm seeking the Holy Ghost. And while I'm seeking the Holy Ghost, hallelujah, the boys are still looking for me. Where are the worshipers in here? Oh, Jesus, for one month and 16 days after baptism in Jesus' name, I was filled with the Holy Ghost. Gotamos to the uttermost. Oh, Jesus, filled with the Holy Ghost now and uh, hallelujah. I was coming from church one night uh, and I'm at uh, Nepal's Plaza that's across from across from the library. You know Great Judge Street across from the library. I was coming out of Barclay Street and when I look coming from the police station direction coming going uptown was the same boy i was coming out of barclay street and he was going uptown and we so one is coming this direction and the other is coming this we are gonna clash now oh jesus the last time he see me i was baker boy the last time that boy sees me i was a dancer the last time he sees me i was a rude boy but now it's a born again boy now this little boy is baptized is in Jesus name now this little boy is filled with the Holy Ghost when I see the boy my heart leapt because he's planning to shoot me now hallelujah but this boy is now under the blood of Jesus Christ so I stop when I see him and something moved in my spirit and said go straight to him and tell him that whatever took place you are sorry I walk straight over to him and make sure I stop in him where touch your neighbor said the righteous is as bold as a lion so I stop in his way and I said excuse me and I said to him, oh, what took place in the past? I am sorry. I am a Christian now. I am baptized in Jesus' name. And I'm serving the Lord. So if I have done you anything, and what took place, I forgive you. And I'm asking you to forgive me. When I said that to the young man, oh, Jesus, it make him feel big now. That just whoop in face. And just look at me and just Hey boy and step off oh i was a babe in christ but i did what the holy ghost tell me to do i approached him and i did my part three days after that i got a news that the same boy was at some place and there was a drive-by oh lord and somebody oh jesus said that gunmen came out of the vehicle point at the same young man and the others the two others that were there with him and one he he got the shot one in his mouth and one in his eyes and the other two get head lick and the three of them die on this part i am not here rejoicing tonight i'm not here rejoicing tonight but i, I was a babe I, I didn't understand nothing but oh jesus after 
years of walking with God I understand this that you see when you make up your mind to live for God when you make the decision that for God I live and for God I die he said when they come against you one way I will scatter them seven different ways so if they don't want to serve God and they want to get out you who are serving God God shall I kill a thousand for your sake I know you don't like this piece but I come here to tell you I didn't understand that time that if God ever call you God is going to protect you if God ever call you God is going to give his angels charge over you if God ever call you then you can put your pot on and I just throw water in the pot sit down and say daddy you promise to feed anybody you call if God ever call you while them are plot God a wipe why them a plan and he said I'll shorten their days if you are my elect I'll push them back if you are willing to work for me so touch your neighbor no one's your neighbor when you come to a church like this prepare yourself to meet God when you come to a church like this answer the call when you come to a church like this give your life to God because the enemies are around you death is after you but if your life is hid in Christ in God no death can get you out before your time I don't care who don't like you I don't care who will fight you if God be for you I want you to go for that who come on somebody I say if God be for you then you can throw your head back and ask the question who can I walk in this house tonight touch your neighbor and say if God be for us then you got to bring the who bring him tonight bring him in Petersville and show me tonight who can beat oh Jesus let me see his hand if his hand is long enough to box with God come on fear of belief he could box with God and God said not same class baby oh Lord God said I don't need to fight with fear me and fear are not upon the same level guess what I'm gonna use and beat fear I'm gonna use frogs God said me now me now fight fear of me me and fear that in the same class so touch your neighbor said the devil and God is not in the same class don't tell nobody that God fight the devil you're a liar right here God and the devil no fight not the same class when God won't be the devil God use all frog God use lice Lord Jesus fear of, you think your heart tough fear you think you're strong fear you think you're bad God said, Come here, lice. I said, I'm going to use lice and break up that. All of a sudden, lice take over fear of house. Lice in my ear, lice on thy arm. Oh, shia. You're not coming with me, man. When God wants to defeat Pharaoh, God just called frog out of the river. I said, come here, frog. Go on in a Pharaoh bathroom. Go on in a Pharaoh kitchen. Make when Pharaoh opening covered. Where is the worship pause? It's kind of tight. You better touch your name as a neighbor. God don't have to fight you. God can use locusts. God, if you ever get God vexed, God will use rat, lizard, fly, and defeat you. You better reach your neighbor, say neighbor. No man can say 
no when God say yes who am I preaching to his yes and amen settled everything if God ever say yes on you if God ever smile on you if God ever decide to bless you I don't care who don't like you if God ever decide to open doors for you I don't care who hate you I feel the power of the Holy Ghost in here. Somebody throw your head back, open your mouth, and tell him thank you. If God be for me, then tell me who shall be against me. If God is on my side, you tell me who shall tribulation, shall peril, shall sword, shall things present, or things to come. What shall separate me from the love of God is there anybody in here that throw your head back and let hell know if God is on my side I can stand tall somebody open your mouth say something open your mouth magnify the king open your mouth and tell him thank you come on and so if God is on your side and storms is coming against you because Jesus said you must build your house upon the rock he speak of two people he said some build your house upon the sun some build your house upon the rock the persons whose life persons who house is built upon the sand is the persons who life is loose sun life sun house is sun life and sun life is people who do what they want to do say what they want to say behave how they want to behave go where they want to go oh jesus lose life sun life but there's a second people that is on the earth their life is built upon the word of god their life is built upon the rock they can wear everything they used to wear they can't go everywhere they used to go they can't say because their life is built upon Christ the solid rock touch your neighbor say look and be good not a loose life baby on Christ the solid rock I stand all on the ground is sinking sand when peace like a river attending my way when sorrows like sea pillars roll whatever my lot that was taught me to say it is well where are the warriors in here it is well no food in the fridge but it is well no money in the bank but it is well rent is high jps come on somebody but it is well come on it is well with my soul there is two kind of people there is one their host is on sun and the other their host is on the rock but guess what Jesus says the storm of life blows on the two house the storm come and it blow the house that is on the sun and it blows on the house that is on the rock in other words whether you are christian 
or you are unsafe, storm I go blow, rough times I go come, trouble I go strike, problem I go come, whether you be Christians, yes I know, when the storm I come, it a blow on everybody house, who am I talking to, trouble can strike, and anybody, sickness can show up, at any man's door, who am I talking to, you better open your mouth, but I come by to tell you, if Christ is in the vessel, you can smile. Who am I talking to? You better drag your neighbor, say neighbor. If Christ is in the vessel, you can ride out your storm. I come with a word. Ride out your storm. Tell somebody, ride it out. Ride it out. Ride out. Your storm, God sent me to tell you, be of good cheer. And if God said be of good cheer, just open your mouth and praise God for this too will pass. Weeping, Shanda Messiah may endure for a night, but come it in the morning, right out. Your storm, I come with a word. I don't care who don't like you. I don't care who I fight you. Write it out. Who am I talking to? Write it out. Write it out. Write it out. For years though, I walk through the shadows of death. I shall Hold me your mouth. Hold me your mouth. Up me your mouth, up me your mouth, ride out your storm, up me your mouth, come on, I said ride out your storm, hold on to your neighbor, and say neighbor, be of good cheer, this too will pass, now I kill you, you shall not die, oh shire. Shanda, ya Messiah, ya Papa Papa Sam, Shanda Messiah. Somebody open your mouth, open your mouth. Take two minutes and let hell know the Lord is my light and my salvation. Tell me whom go for him and bring him over here. Tell me whom. Shall I fear the Lord is the strength of my life? Of whom shall I be afraid when the wicked, my enemies, and my foes come up against me to eat up my flesh? They shall stumble and fall to one host and clamp it against me. In this Will I be confident? One thing, I feel the Holy Ghost in here. I feel him in my hands. I feel him in my feet. I feel the Holy Ghost stretching out in me. You better reach your neighbor, say neighbor. If you feel him, don't quench him. If you feel the Holy Ghost, no quench the Holy Ghost. This is not the Baptist. This is not the Methodist. Not the Roman Catholic. You're in Holy Ghost Church. If you feel him, express him. If you feel goose pimple, if you feel the ghost, the goose pimple, or the cool bomb, open your mouth and give God a praise. Whether you are a sinner or you're saved, open your mouth. Let everything that have breath open your mouth and give God a crazy praise. Somebody shout again. Take a praise break in here. Take a praise break in here. Take a praise break. Open your mouth and send up some praise. Open your mouth and lift Jesus higher. Open your mouth and shout a glory. Shout a glory, hallelujah. 